Did you know that PLA is actually one of the strongest materials? And yes, I'm talking about good old fashioned regular PLA, not even the PLA Pro or Polymax PLA kind. This is just because it's a little confusing when we talk about strength, because strength can be defined in so many different ways. And PLA shines in some of those strength categories. First, let's talk about tensile strength. PLA actually shines great when it comes to tensile strength. PLA has a very high tensile strength, just regular old basic PLA. But strength isn't just about tension. PLA actually shines as well in compression strength, outperforming ABS, PETG, and nylon. And then to top it all off, PLA also has some great flexural strength as well. So don't count out PLA when you talk about, I need a strong material. Actually, here I am sitting on another Polymaker employee's shoulder while we ride a full PLA bike by the real Sam Prentice. Yes, this electric bike you see us riding right now is entirely made out of PLA, except for the treads on the tire being TPU. So this PLA bike held up to our 400 pounds. It's actually a lot stronger than you think it is. That said, obviously most people don't consider PLA strong because of a few points. Number one being it has a low impact strength. This means if you drop it or hit it with a hammer, it will very likely break. Then of course, PLA also has a low heat resistance strength, meaning it could start to deform at around 55 to 60 degrees Celsius. So the next time you suggest PLA when somebody's asking for a strong material and they say, no, I said I need a strong material, you can make sure to let them know, did you know that PLA is actually strong? The more you know.